Let's check out this cool little feature that will be coming out in iOS 17. It's called Standby. This is going to turn your iPhone into a nice digital clock now for free. The thought behind it is that you're going to be able to wake up, see all your calendar views, what's happening in the day, or you just leave it for a nice bedside or room clock. The iPhone does have to be plugged into power for this feature to work. So I've been using my favorite charger over here, this little coat rack looking thing, the Belkin 3-in-1 charger, which works great for standby as it elevates the iPhone and you can turn it into landscape mode to achieve this standby clock. The charger is a bit expensive, but I really love this thing and I use it all the time. I count my blessings whenever I put my iPhone onto these MagSafe charging pads. You can check out the review of the charger up here in the corner. It's just really nice when everything is integrated into your Apple ecosystem. So let's check out the standby app real fast and see how it looks and see what options we have available. Once you have iOS 17 beta uploaded, you just can scroll down in your settings. You're going to notice this new tab here called standby. You just click that and you'll see a couple options here. You've got this night mode, which turns it into a red tint at night. And so once you get that turned on, flip your phone into landscape mode and just press the power back on. Boom, you got your standby mode. You can see your battery percentage there popped up. So that'll always let you know how much longer you got to go. You got your photos there. I gotta unlock those in a second. Here's the main screen with your widgets and the idea behind it is you've got your updates as soon as you wake up or when you're going to bed. You've got your weather, your calendar, uh, it's very easy to add a bunch of other widgets on here. I'm, I'm sure they're going to be getting developers to make other third-party app extensions for this. So here's clicking into your photos. You know, you've got all your albums and different things. Here's the main clock face. You've got a few different options here. You can see your alarm clock. Uh, when that's set, uh, there's only a few right now, but I'm sure just like the other widgets, they're going to have a bunch of other clock faces that you can add in here. All the UI has been kind of changed and works well now in landscape mode. You can play music, uh, adjust the volume, you know, this is now your main HomePod station if you want it to be. So if you've ever been interested in one of those smart clocks to have on your nightstand like the Amazon Echo Show, and there's a bunch of other ones out there, now Apple has given you this feature for free, and the new iOS 17 is expected to drop in September with those new iPhone 15s. Or you can check it out right now by signing up for the developer app beta program, it's pretty easy to do. I think this feature would be really great on the iPads also. There's been talk of a HomePod iPad type home system coming out by Apple, I could definitely see the standby mode being the prototype for that. So thanks for checking out the video everyone. Please hit that subscribe button. We're going to be checking out a lot more new features in iOS 17, Watch OS 10. There's going to be a lot of stuff coming down the pipeline for iOS 17, a lot of new features. So until the next one, keep it in standby mode. Take care.